Hello everyone, this is Bucket of Jam and I'm here on Portal as promised. So yeah, basically that's uh that's it, let's get started. Uh I'm actually quite looking forward to playing Portal since um I'm a computer scientist and I'm actually yet to play it, so <laughs> it's about time I tried it. Oh, I recognise this radio song actually. Yeah, also being a computer scientist, I get a lot of references from everyone. Uh, okay, yeah, I've got that. A lot of the controls are fairly basic. It's definitely a source game. Hello, uh, and Steam. again, welcome Ooh. to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur. For your own safety and the safety of others, please refrain from... Turn back. <laughs> the portal will open in three, two, one. I kind of want to know how to pick up the radio. Anyway, hey look, it's me, Paul Warman. <laughs> so, yeah, like I say, I get a lot of references from being a computer scientist because everyone's played Portal on my course, pretty much. So, obviously I know like the really obvious ones, like uh, Cake is obviously a lie and stuff like that. But, ah, uh, it's E to pick up stuff. <sighs> Can I go back and get the, Ah, oh, I can't go back and get the radio, well. Oh well. Um, so yeah, I can tell this is a <laughs> a, a Valve game. Excellent. Because as the crouching is really low. Please proceed into the after completing each test. Oh, yeah, First, uh, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material prevents a patient grip will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. Oh, I'm just looking forward to playing this game. Um, it seems a bit loud, actually. All right, let's go. So yeah, I also put subtitles on just in case, like I don't know. I don't know. I just thought subtitles would be a good idea, just so that I know exactly what's being said because I have a tendency to miss things uh, that get said. So I think it'd be a good way to. Uh, ooh. Yeah, it'd be a good way to kind of, I don't know, just make Please sure I know Please place the weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt aperture science heavy duty super colliding super button. <laughs> uh, you know what, I really love this game. But I feel like I've done something wrong. Where there's no cube. Yes, please. So there's the cube. Aha, uh -huh, I see. No! Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> waiting for the portal, waiting for the portal. Waiting, waiting, waiting for the portal. Yet yeah, wait. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. Perfect. Please move quickly to the chamber lock, as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. <laughs> oh wow, I'm already enjoying this game, just because it's like, I don't know. It just gives me that feel like, I sort of, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it, it's just kind of... It's already entertaining. Like, super button or whatever it was, I don't know. So, I don't know how long this uh, series is going to be, hopefully not too long, because, I don't know, there's still Portal 2 to get through as well, maybe. <laughs> um, loading. And it appears to have just stopped. Oh wait, there we go. We're up again. Uh, I've heard it's a fairly You're short game. Very well. Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. <laughs> 
Alright, let's get in here, let's get in here. What was the purpose of coming in here? Let's just go back through. It does seem quite loud, I have to say. Can I take this? Very good. Damn straight. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. Yay. With it, you can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Okay. Most importantly, under no circumstances should you... Okay, I get that. See, I've played um, I've played Portal 2 multiplayer before, so I kind of already know how to play the game, sort of, a little bit. Uh, I don't know what to expect from this one though, because I haven't actually I played the multiplayer campaign with my uh, brother, so I don't know what to expect from the uh, single player or anything. Please proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. Hmm. Portal then. Portal here. I feel like... Oh. I'm just getting confused. I thought I was meant to have an orange portal somewhere, but I guess that's already supplied well to Well done. Me. Remember, the Aperture Science Bring Your Daughter to Work Day is the perfect time to have her tested. <laughs> Seems like a fairly straightforward game so far, though. I imagine it'll get more complicated, but we'll see. We'll see. I'm looking forward to getting into it. So, just in case you haven't been able to tell, it's uh, I might be I might be being a little bit quieter. It's quite late at night here, so it's uh, I put my watch off so I can't actually see what time it is. But it's past midnight, probably verging on one in the morning. Welcome to test chamber so, four. You're doing quite well. Yay! Uh, I'm back at university now, so of course I'll have flatmates who will be like, "What the hell are you on about talking and all that?" And I'll just, oh, I don't know, I guess I'll just have to be like, yeah, doing YouTube and stuff. Once but again, whatever. excellent work. As part of a required test protocol, we will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. Oh, fine, being that way. <laughs> I'll be fine. So anyway, yeah, they've, they've probably got flatmates sleeping and stuff, so I don't want to be too loud. Uh, just so I don't wake them up. You'll see though, uh, it's yeah, it's the first night after I finished my exams, so I was just kind of looking forward to recording. It's the uh, first thing I've recorded since, like, last week, I think. Um, there's the boxes up there. Yes. And if I do that, there we go. Whoops. See, I can do a portal. Saying that though. Interesting. Okay. So it knows that there is another box down here. Okay, so I can't do that shit from up there. That wasn't too bad. So I've been looking forward to playing Portal for quite a while. As part of a required uh, test protocol, no. our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, <laughs> one. I think... I didn't know I could do that. That was quite funny. Woo. There we go, making progress. So yeah, I've been looking forward to playing this for quite a while. Um, uh, Pincer from the uh, Aretas server, kind of, I've been telling him, oh yeah, well, I want to do Portal. And just, I don't know, earlier today I was saying, yeah, I'm going to record some Portal. And he's like, you've been saying that for the last, like, two months. It's true, I have been intending to do Portal for a While safety is one, one of now. many enrichment center goals, the Aperture Science High Energy Pellet seen to the left of the chamber can and has caused permanent disabilities such as vaporization. <laughs> Please be careful. What? Oh. Go, go, go. Unbelievable. Yay. You. Subject name here. Must be the pride of. <laughs> Subject on down here. <laughs> jam, jam of Bristol, I guess. Yay. 
Alright, moving on. Whoops. So yeah, it seems to be going fairly quickly so far. I don't really know how how to split the episodes or how long to uh, make in between. I don't know, just I don't know where to split the episodes because I forgot to check what time I started recording. Uh, Warning devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate the high energy pellet and have therefore been disabled for your safety. Good. Now use the aperture science unstationary scaffold to reach the chamber lock. Unstationary scaffold. I love, I love the way they put things on this game, it's just funny. Right then, bring the unstationary scaffold to me. Okay. Go, go, go. What was I saying? Uh, I cannot remember what I was talking about now, I've lost my track. Oh yeah, uh, breaking up the episodes. I'm probably going to do somewhere between 20 and 30 minute episodes, but oh, I'm going to get time pieces so I can see what time it is. I'm going to grab my watch. So I reckon I've been recording for about mm, 15 minutes so far, I would guess. Hmm, so that's a probably a good guess. I'll record for like another 5 minutes and then I'll stop recording there. Hopefully it'll be in a convenient location. Please know that we have added a consequence for failure. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. Oh, so kind, so kind. Oh, damn it. So close. Go, go, go. Hey. What? Oh. Ah, I see. Right, okay. It's gonna go. Pops out of existence and then it goes through there and then here. Wait. Wait. Oh. And then there. Oh, damn it. Wait, that's right. Come on, come on. Come on. Yeah. So now. What? 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 Oh. I see, I see. I'm not a derp, don't worry. Okay, I'm a little bit of a derp, but whatever. Ooh! This isn't meant to happen. Okay, on the unstationary scaffold. Whew, making good progress, I think. Um, anyway, I noticed this was number 8 out of 19, so I think I'll cut the episode after number 10, because that's like halfway through, so. Very impressive. Please note that any yeah. appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing experience. Yay. Actually, yeah, I'll uh, cut the recording after the next area. No, yeah, after the area 10. Because that, that's a nice, that's a fair amount of episode, I think. Um, considering, well, considering the time mainly. <laughs> it's like in the morning right now. Um, the Enrichment Center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Oh, joy. Make no attempt to solve it. Okay, if you insist. Uh, I will make an attempt. The Enrichment Center apologizes for this clearly broken test chamber. <laughs> Fantastic. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. Yeah. <laughs> so, making good progress, I think, um, considering we're already like halfway through this first area. I assume it's the first area anyway. Um, doing good, doing good. I'm not sure how my commentary is though. So hopefully it's all right. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure it's all right. I'll have to listen to it back after I, uh, you know, after I edit it and everything. I don't know. I'm just. I'm not used to uh, playing this sort of game Hello on again. camera. So. To reiterate. Gobbled. <laughs> uh, 
I wonder if, um, wait, it's momentum. So if I do this, hey, see, I can do momentum. So yeah, if you guys don't, uh, don't like subtitles, then actually I'll probably be doing most of my recording tonight. Or at least some recording. I'll be doing more than just this episode, so you'll have to let me know, like, some more time, but... You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. Yay. Wait, I just thought maybe the point of this game is that the portals, the orange portal's already there and you only have the blue port. I don't know. <laughs> I'll work it out. Um... Here. Ooh, hello. So I guess you'll put it there. And then jump down, that should work. It's all about physics. Momentum. A function of mass and velocity is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. <laughs> there you go, sort of physics. Physics in a nutshell. Oops, I appeared to be upside down. Oh well. So yeah, that looks like it. that's it for this episode. Hope you guys have enjoyed the first episode of Portal. Um, I, there'll be uh, more to come. Probably, probably uploading one every two days. I think that seems fair. Um, but I'll be doing quite a bit of recording tonight, I think. Because, I don't know, it's a fun game. And shouldn't be much outside noise. Because that's one thing that, throughout the day can sometimes get in my way, like outside noise and stuff. So we'll just get a quick look at number 11. The Enrichment Center promises to always provide a safe testing environment. In dangerous testing environments, the Enrichment Center promises to always provide useful advice. For instance, the floor here will kill you. Try to avoid it. Alright, I'll bear that in mind, but the, uh, I'm afraid the suspense will have to wait until next episode so like I say again if you don't like the uh, subtitles just let me know in the comments and I will turn them off but I, th I quite like them I think it's helpful <laughs> yeah, but it's up to you guys you know you're the ones watching the videos so yeah uh, thank you for watching and I will see you next time bye bye to ensure the safe performance of all authorized activities do not destroy vital testing apparatus Ah, but I was having I was having fun destroying it Oh well, if you insist. Anyway, yes, thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.